Ladies and gentlemen, how are you? Welcome to Adult Education Ingredient. My name is Rosalia Wong. Guess what I'm going to bring to you today? Today, the topic is called How Adults Learn. So the social, cultural, critical theory and feminist pedagogy say so much about how adults learn. Um, it, the research and findings was done by Miliam in 1993. So what do you mean by social, cultural, critical theory and feminist pedagogy. The way we learn we should apply social cultural critical theory and feminist pedagogy it is pretty much the same way as when we want to know more about children we use early learning childhood. For more information on feminist pedagogy please watch the video from the link above. For awesome advices and suggestions uh, please Put me through by message me on the comment below and I will give you more insights into what you need to know about your profession and your organizations. Okay, now, um, older adults do not learn as fast as younger adults as we all know, but older adults do um, learn when and rather higher in the ability and power um, in the area of like learning compares to younger adults when you remove the pressure from them. So adults uh, do score better, by better scores in some aspects of intelligence. According to Marianne's suggestion of some intelligent tests, for example, the fluid and crystalline intelligence test by Catters in 1963 and 1987. For example, intelligence tests by Gil Fox in 1967 the intelligence test of structure of intellectual and also the intelligence um, test of motive or uh, poor intelligence test by Gartner's in 1987 and also tragic theory intelligence test by Sternberg's in 1985. Uh, all these uh, intelligence tests do uh, prove that adults do, do score better in some aspects of intelligence and uh, it was put forward by Marian. Okay? Now, Age do influence the ability for us or for adults to remember. Also, age influences the ability for adults to process information. Age influences the ability for adults to problem solving. Okay, how is it? For example, in the laboratory put forward by Malian that adults do not remember some nonsense syllabus as good as young people. But adults do remember those huge blocks of technical information that are related to their jobs. <sighs> okay, now here we must not forget about wisdom. Okay, wisdom is very important. Wisdom to many consider as the pinnacle of cognitive development. Wisdom also is um, experientially defined and culturally bound. Malcolm Knowles introduced the European concept of anthropology 25 years ago to North American adult educators. Here, another feature of anthropology is, is the features of adult learning. So what do you mean by anthropology? Anthropology is the art and science to help adult learners. It is a very important feature of, of adult learning and a very important feature of anthropology is self-directed learning. Okay. Now, for Olson, uh, for sorry, for aspects of adult learning and adult learning theory, uh, through self-directed learning, please watch the videos from the link above. For many years, anthropology uh, provide a set of um, guidelines for uh, designing instruction which for the learners who prefer self-directed learning than teacher-oriented learning. So the hallmark of um, anthropology is um, becoming critically aware of how and why our presumption is, have become constrained to the way we perceive the world, the way we understand the world, and the way we feel about the world, while not using adult learning to reformulating our assumption as to permit more um, permeable, more discriminable, and more interactive as well as more inclusive approach to our decision making and also to our new understanding of the world around us. I like the point where in the book where Marianne was pointing out that we need resource in order to counter the load 
which leads to power. Okay, so here we need to realize the many things and knowledge that exist in our brain, and address them. Address that where the knowledge from, why, when, and how. That way, it will give us the power. And remember the phrase, knowledge is power. When you realize the words, resource, and power, and the results we gain will be a life that will help you to engage in the real learning. Okay, that's all from me to you today. Please, if you have any uh, suggestions or you want any awesome suggestions or advices, please put me through by leaving a message on the comment section below. I will bring you more insights into what you need to know about your profession and your organizations. Thank you for tuning in today and also please do subscribe to my channel and like my video as I will bring you more. Thank you for tuning in. Have a good day and goodbye.